Dallas. He's like Dallas the city, but with an E. Dallas. Is anyone going to type in before the final boss has a black screen of death, like E7 on, on Steam? <laughs> this is the origin story video game. Literally, Origins of Texas. I have, to, I have to not get hit as much as possible to get ready for the harder phases. Possible. He's releasing the demonic essence within him. That's what Sigma does every fucking stream. The the art the art is very good on these uh what company is, is Trails and E's, uh, um, Falcon? The art is always nice. And now the art is ugly, because <laughs> it's the final boss. This is exactly, exactly where I was when E's 7 final boss froze. Or had a black screen, I mean, not froze. It looks like a ripoff. It seems like a ripoff of uh, Part 7 so far, a little bit. I'm getting hit a little bit much. Okay, that's one phase down to down, down, down. Okay, that did not help. What what am I supposed to attack here? I see blue. Do I have to attack his, like, side things that are next to him? What am I supposed to attack? That's zero. Do you guys know what I'm supposed to attack on phase two? I'm doing all zeros. Match the magic to the same color. 
What are you talking about? There's no blue color magic, by the way. That's not how we work here, Sean. You should know that after five fucking years. You guys are allowed to help out in any possible way. There's no such thing as a blue element attack that Unica has, though. So... I am... Uh, technically, I am doing one. I just might be under-leveled again. It's possible that I'm under-leveled. You hit power down bottom... What? What? Oh, oh, I, okay, so the, the one damage is good enough. <laughs> Click to show. Jesus. You don't take orders from Sean. You literally do not take orders from Sean. It's been way too many years since I've seen him. And you literally took an order from him instead of the person that fucking runs the channel. It's just, it just confused me that it did one damage on the shield. It should not have done one damage, it should have... It should have been something to destroy or break. You know what I mean? So, like, th this should not be doing one, it should be doing a large amount of damage. It should make me feel good that I'm doing damage enough to kill the shield. Just like playing three houses and killing a shield of a giant... Giant monster or whatever. I guess, I guess this blue color is, is technically green here. On this phase, it's technically green. I'm getting hit a little bit too much because I'm getting greedy. Oh, the last phase. Oh, shit. It could be the last phase. It's yellow looking at the moment. Ew! Oh my god, wait. Oh shit, it's changing. It's rapidly changing. Fuck. What are we doing on this phase? Oh my god, what is this? Okay, am I supposed to be doing damage to him? The little ad? I have to do damage to the ads, I think. There could be a thousand more phases. That does not bode well for me, getting hit by two fucking hundred. <clears throat> That's helpful right there. <laughs> Ad block, of course. The defense is so damn, so damn good. I'm just getting hit without caring too much. You guys are lucky that I can pick other difficulties with Hugo later. Whoa, 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 okay, now we're there, now we're there. I might as well use that move on this phase. Just when he's hittable. If I don't kill that other second one over there, then he might regenerate the, the second ad, the first ad again. Why is he off the fucking screen? Like, come back here, you bitch. Stay over here. I have to waste that move. It's gonna be good damage. Oh, that's the end of the game, I think. Unless, unless phase four loads. It could be phase four, any second. X5? Huh. 
just like all the Ease games, it is very, very rare for me to to call something an an eighty percent out of out of one hundred. I'm gonna have to check my score sheet to see what I did with the others, but they're all eighty percent games. They're it, they're just all addicting. Gameplay first, storyline on the side. Yep, the whole series is all a bunch of eighty scores. I don't even have Origins listed. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it above Ease One because it's technically a prequel. I can't really admit that this is be uh, this is any better than three, four, six, or seven, which I played. It's kind of all the same. Oh, it looks like I loved seven a lot, lot. I like seven a very large amount. This game might have tied with three for me, but like it might have might have tied with three. But I would I would choose Origin because it's just a little bit a little bit more fun. A little bit more balanced with less te uh, tediousness sometimes. Uh, yeah, eighty five. But the the game of the year was uh, Skies of Arcadia, which would really be like. Almost 100 if it has a remaster. If Skies of Arcadia ever gets a remaster, the 83 that I gave to it is going to go to a 93. It just has to be a sensational remaster with modern modern things and speed, like speed. Ways to speed things up. My, my Ease Origin score can, can raise if I get to the third, uh, the third character in the future. It, it could go up. My score for this game could go up based on the uh, third uh, character redoing it all from scratch. know if bland is the word it's it's super super short it plays like oath but o oath had a lot of like irritating back sometimes it was backtracking that irritated me like origins is automatically better to me because it, it's literally just a dungeon only it, it's like it's like if persona 3 was only tartarus i would be very happy i would still be just as happy with persona 3 if it was only tartarus nothing else that's what makes me like origin better than oath but those stupid fucking maggot maggots. <laughs> Don't worry, I did not say the bannable word. Those fucking maggots on oath irritate the shit out of me. They fucking like eat eat you at your feet and you're dead. It just has some annoying like stoppages parts that is too hard to deal with on oath. Origin was more to the point and just 25 floors with 25 25 uh, fast travels. It's it's kind of more my kind of thing. In fact, that's exactly what I'm typing right now in my thoughts uh, section here, the third tab of the sheet. I, d I don't even know if such a difficulty existed on Oath, you know, six years ago. But it, it's really not about that, though, lad. Like, I, I might have been less annoyed by dying from those stupid maggots. I would have been less annoyed in those situations, but it's still not a world that's that's as fun as, as doing 25 floor dungeons. It reminds me of playing Shining, Shining in the Darkness as a kid. You know, playing Origins, except it's, except it's not first person, it's just, it's cause it's a dungeon and that's it. Which is a giant plus. Yeah, 
Ease continues to be must play. That's that's the only sentence I really need to type on the score sheet. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I clicked on the wheel by accident, guys. I have to like I didn't I didn't even update the odds yet. I have to update the odds during the end credits. Uh well, you know, shining shining the holy ark by the same company shining the holy ark is the next game kind kind of it's not the same world or the same characters but it's still shining and it's still camelot so it's for, it's for the sega saturn i streamed it i streamed it 9 years ago docking you you should have known that i streamed it you fucker fuck you docking you fucking should have known cuz you knew me you fucking knew me it was a it was a few months before the before you were playing uh, secret of mana Docking 236 bot command. <laughs> it, it was a couple months, it was like a month or two before that highlight video in chat right there. <clears throat> Docking, you're supposed to remember everything though. You know what's funny? I, I actually, I, I do fully, fully remember everything that's uh, happened. Every game is, is remembered by me of, of what's been played. It, it means it means I know what I'm in the mood for, kind of. Huh? It feels it feels like the halfway point of the stream because it is, but I got on late, so it's already the end of the night. Just got to spin a wheel. Exactly correct, Docking. <laughs> That's actually very, uh... You just missed it, Darkfire. You only missed it by, like, two minutes. <clears throat> this is still your favorite Ease game, though, Darkfire. <clears throat> you tell those people at work, Fuck you, I'm going back and I'm watching Borg beat Ease Origin. It's, it's on them to understand how good E's Origin was, and, and yes, it is a must-play 80, again. Every E's game ever made so far is an 80%. I've never played Bump Combat games, though, Part 1. I only died 49 times, Docking. You, know what? you always exaggerate, you know it was only 49. <clears throat> I, I, sto I stopped game overing, to be honest. I stopped game overing when the double jump was obtained. The minute I got the double jump, the enemies did not have a chance. <clears throat> I think I would have been getting hit a little bit more on, on Norm, just like last year on Part 7. Each each hit against me would have been... would have been triple. So probably like six instead of two for each fire. I'll be doing the two other endings after a break, Darkfire. You just gotta frickin' like, just pray that it wins. And remember though, uh, Ease 8 could win before Origin wins again. <clears throat> this game, this game already rightfully won a spin, so it will be able to be boosted for free. <clears throat> you can boost it even more with points. The, the E series is just too good. It's too good, so like I don't even need that long of a break until I br until I put eight uh, back onto a wheel. It's just like too fun, and I I think playing this for only eight hours is pretty tiny. You know, eight, eight hours is too tiny. So what that means is like I I could use more ease this year, as long as one of the games wins. Alright, uh, 
Let's watch the end credits and I'll update the wheel. There's only a few things that are uh, boosted. Just gotta update the wheel here. Uh, let's see. Nobody boosted Baton Kaito. There's two boosts to DQ5. That's on the bottom. Development members. Okay, let's see, where's FF5 Etrian? Let's see, Etrian, uh, let's see, FF5 was boosted once. Arceus could win, you never know. Breath of Fire 4 is on the wheel, Led. Hey, hey, Led, you can boost Breath of Fire 4. According to Rigstorm, it's the best in the entire franchise. I'll be on the wheel layout any second, I'm sure this is short. Actually, oops, oh, the X button. I just hit the X button by accident.